Now, one representative from our area is pushing for the 25th Amendment and impeachment after being uh, or living through, I should say, the deadly Capitol riot on Wednesday. And Congressman Tom O'Halloran says Trump needs to be removed in order to stabilize the country and send a message to the world. Now, your sites, Brian Brennan has more. As a former police officer, Congressman O'Halloran has been in dangerous situations before, but as a lawmaker, he says democracy can't function under the threat of violence. Thousands of people storm the Capitol, some of them appearing ready to take hostages. Congressman Tom O'Halloran says it was nothing short of an insurrection. They came equipped to break into the Capitol, to get by police lines. They were armed. Uh, uh, they... They had a goal in mind. He was one of the many lawmakers forced into hiding. You could see people's hands coming through the doors, heads coming through the doors as far as uh, looking into the chambers. And uh, uh, once we got to the stairwells, uh, we were, uh, we were uh, being told they're right behind us. And they were. O'Halloran says the violence was spurred by statements from President Trump and his family. Saying to people that they were, they were good people and we need you to go and march and, and, and his son saying things like, you know, uh, we need to take it over. And, and, and I mean, that is just crazy talk in America by our leadership. He says the deadly riot shows how fast things can turn. It can happen in an hour. I mean, the, the unstable environments for, the, for our country is not good. O'Halloran says he will be voting on a resolution for the vice president to invoke the 25th Amendment. And if that fails, the House will be ready to move forward with impeachment. He thinks it's a message the United States needs to send to the world. I, I just don't understand how people can say, well, we only have this many days left. Uh, the, the people on the outside world looking at America right now, they're not saying that. They're saying what's going to happen in those eight days. Brian Brennan, KGUN 9, on your side.